Drum roll, please. Hey there, Ultimate Yoshi here. Welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. Last episode, we took care of some mundane jobs, and then we discovered that the pseudo rescue team failed to rescue AC Team ACT from the ground on place. So now we're gonna go to the ground on place and try our luck. Are we all ready to roll? All set. Should get a good night's sleep then. We'll roll out. A plus. A freaking plus. Right there. Right then and there. Damage. Ellipses. Ellipses? I'm in that dream again. Hi, Gardevoir. Ellipses. Gardevoir. It's tomorrow, isn't it? That you take to that underground... That, what? What does that mean? Because that means that there's some going there? I guess? I've never heard that before. Yes. They make it sound like one terrible place. I wonder if we'll be okay. We'll be fine. I'm certain that you will succeed, Saizan. You have my support. Please, go with strength. I will. Thank you. I'm feeling a little braver now. I will go for it. By the, by the way, Gardevoir, do you know? What's it like underground? Or what Groudon is like? No. I'm sorry to say. I can't envision it. Okay. Thought maybe you knew something the way you said it. No. I only wanted to give you encouragement. I'm sorry. She looks so sad in that portrait. Look at her. No, no, no that's fine too. I'm happy you tried to cheer me up. Thank you. But... There is one thing that I can foresee. Huh? Your role is coming to its end, little by little. My role is ending? You became a Pokemon in order to fulfill a certain role. And that role brought you here. Now, that role is finally drawing to its conclusion. Gardevoir, tell me! What is my role? Why did I become a Pokemon? When the time comes, I think I can tell you when this adventure is finished. Au revoir. Hey, only I'm allowed to sometimes use a French phrase. Not you. Whatever. All right. Siron, let's go. This is it. Let's give it our best and rescue Alexam. Alon Z. Gardevoir said she will tell me everything when this adventure is over. Is going underground the adventure she meant? Will she tell me if we rescue Alkazam's team? Hey! What, are you stunned? Let's go already! Well, I'm gonna save real quick. Just so that I don't have to sit through that cutscene again. And I'm gonna show you my items list. Reviver Seeds! So yeah. Magma Cavern. That sounds like fun! I'll fit right at home in here. Theron will have a type advantage, so that'll be nice. So this is it. The underground cavern where Groudon is. Look at the flowing streams of lava. It wouldn't surprise me if the dungeon is scorching hot. Other rescue teams should already be inside. Let's get in there and give it our best. You never see any other rescue teams ever. You know what would be cool? If they had, sometimes on occasion on the other floors, they had friendly Pokemon who helped you out in a dungeon and would kill enemies and... Just, they would, like, go through the map for you, and if you met them, they could, like, sh share items or something. That would be cool if they did that. They never did that in any of the other Pokemon Mystery Dungeon games. I don't know if they ever really had any time when it was like, Oh, there's a Pokemon rescue team over here. I will, Siron, I will get you to attack this Nidoqueen. Sometime. There we go. Bing. Ah, uh, this is another really memorable song. I haven't heard this one in a while, though, Magma Cavern. Never gotten here in a long, long time. I've tried- well, this is only actually the third time I've played this game. All the way through. Oh, hi. That's not gonna helpful. Um, how about Amber Plus One? I never will ever get Flamethrower. That doesn't do- oh god, you have Peck. 
Luckily, you're not a bird, so you don't do a million damage to me and kill me instantly. But I don't like Peck. Oh, hey. What was I talking about? I don't know. I, I... Oh, yeah, this is the only... Oh, hi. This is only the third time that I've actually played through this whole game in, in its entire... I've tried to play through this game, and this is only the second time where I've actually gotten this far. First time was when I beat it, which was in 2006 when this game came out. Probably one of the last ever games on the Game Boy Advance. And the second time was... I'm not sure how recently it was, but it wasn't... It was a while ago, but also wasn't super terribly long ago. I'm gonna eat this. I'm not sure how long this dungeon would, is. I'm gonna guess that the first half is around 20 floors. That seems like a reasonable estimate. And if it's longer, then I'll be disappointed. If it's shorter, then I will be pleasantly surprised. Siron. Siron. Siron! One of these days. There we go. Ah! We haven't really encountered any fire types yet. Mostly, mostly it's been ground types. I mean, I know it's an underground area, but it's also called Magma Cavern. You would expect a mixture of the two. Especially with all the lava everywhere. But no, it's just ground type so far. I don't think fire's effective against ground, though. I c I'm not familiar with some of the more uncommon types. Like, I know the obvious ones, like fire is weak to water and stuff. No! Oh! Go away! Don't like you. Don't hit me. Thank you. Bye. Alright, I'm going to eat an Oran Berry. Don't want to take any chances, and I'm going to pick up that apple because I might eat it. I don't- I only had two apples in my toolbox, so I don't- Wow, I'm, I'm getting really- I'm good so far at finding the exits. Like, I haven't really encountered a scenario where it's like, where the heck is the exit? I've been- gen There was a couple of floors where I was like, going a very roundabout way of getting there, but it's still, for the most part- Oh, hi. Can I use you, Ember, on you? Can I use you, Ember, on you? Grammar! Watch out, Cake! Get over here. What does Mudsport do? I think it weakens water. I'm not a water type, buddy. You couldn't even see Siron. That's a dead end. Bloop up. Hi. Oh, I killed you. You don't have a lot of health. Well, then again, that was a critical hit. Wow, sir, really? I had one detour and then I found it. Like, I am, okay, fiery now. It's very fiery now. Siron, I hope you don't dehydrate. Arbok picked up Silver Spike 7. What happened to Silver Spike 6 through 1? I, almost, I don't know what I almost said, but it wasn't the right number. Attack the Magmar. Thank you. Let me check what Siron's move set is. He has water gun and rapid speed. Hmm. I'll keep water gun on him because that's very helpful and can hit from long range, but. Hmm. <laughs> bum bum bum. Oh, hi, Mobile. Oh, hi, Arbok. Hi, Arbok. Again. I don't know what to talk about. So, how you guys doing? You doing good? I hope you're doing good. Hello, what? Oh. Hmm. Oh, that was a critical hit, though. Ow. 
astonishing. I was astonished. Astonishing. I said that already. I'm so astonished that I'm repetitive. The worst kind of astonish. Yes. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Words are failures. Okay, so this isn't exactly the most effective move, but it gets the job done eventually. Oh, hey, I grew a level. That's nice. That means Theron's about to grow a level too. One level higher than me. Theron, come over here. Thank you. Here we go, I found the egg. Whoa. Ow. The cargo in his silver spikes. I move. Oh, hey! I love it when this happens in the harder dungeons. <laughs> that was a weird job. Now I don't know what I to talk about. Is this gonna be a useful to him? No, it's frustration. That's frustrating. Okay. Oh, hey! <laughs> but that, that's like three floors in a row where I've started... Four floors in a row where I've started in the exit room. I was going swimmingly. I hope I don't start swimming in lava soon. Even though I'm a fire type, that won't really be very fun. Actually, Metal Claw was super effective against Rhydon. He's a ground type, so maybe I should keep Metal Claw. And this is it. I didn't really look at the map. Two hundred and. Eight damage? Holy freaking crap! Imagine how much damage that would have done if Siron had Torrent. I'm gonna close this stupid new updates are available tiny little message bubble on my computer. I don't care about that. Windows updates is stupid. Here we go. Uh, you know what? We can take him. Or. By we, I mean Siron. A+. Plus. I'm gonna check out what these items are. Are they just gonna be sp- No, that. Let's eat! Yum! Status checker! I don't really care what that does. Oh, hi guys! How are you? Here, I'll let Saron help. Bam! Saron's gonna be great against Groudon if... If his moves are doing this much damage. Plus, after the whole spiel with Articuno, we're super high level. I don't think I've ever been this... Well, I probably got this high level in the post-game of my first playthrough. But, yeah, I don't... This is a really high level for me. Secret power? It's a secret to everybody. Oh, hi, Grimer. Uh, can I hit you with this? Saron! Handle it! Handle it, I said. Stop attacking Sand Slash. Sand Slash can't do anything to you. Wow. Saron's just... Well, Golden's not doing anything to him. Why are you using Rapid Spin so much? Are, are all your other moves depleted? No, they're not. What we'll gives, Siron? Whatever, he's not exactly the sharpest light bulb. I... I'm not exactly the sharpest light bulb, I guess. God. Combining phrases is A+. Plus. Want a sharp light bulb? Just break it on counter. Inst instant murder weapon. The best murder weapon is an icicle, though, because stab someone with one of those, that will hurt. And not only that, the murder weapon will just melt. Perfect. I'm out of most everything else, so let's hidden power. Not, not too bad damage. Wise. Oh, you son of a friggin'. Ow. Okay, you're dead. Siron, use a water move. That's not a water move. <laughs> <laughs> a 
Okay, um... Cranberry, please! 69 health! I have a belly of 100. Whoa. What the heck is that all about? I don't know. Anyways... Yeah. We haven't really encountered a whole lot of fire types. That, that surprises me. It's a ma- It's called Magma Cavern. I know it's like an underground area, but still. You would think there would be some fire types. It's mostly just ground, though. Diddle-lum bum bum bum. bum bum bum. I don't care. Screw you. Whoa! Oh no! Sorry for peeking the mic. Oh god. Oh god. Things were going too well. Oh my god. The music of nightmares. Monster houses have finally shown up. Okay, so the basic premise of, of Monster House is this. In later dungeons, there will be one room on a floor that will show up. And... I need a max elixir. I'm gonna ingest it for my first time. For one... I, 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 okay, I'm gonna... I need to concentrate. On what I'm saying. For one, in one room of a random floor, and it could be multiple floors too, there will be a monster house. This basically means that in one random room, usually it has a bunch of items in it. Could be small, could be big. Not, this is an average size room right here. But in one... Hold on. Let me switch that out. And I'm also going to switch out rapid spins, so that's not very helpful right now. Uh, um... One room will have... appear to have no enemies in it. But the moment you step inside, bam bam bam, straight from the ceiling, a million, a million Pokemon just show up out of nowhere. They are one of the reasons why this game can get really difficult. I, this might even be the first place where they even show up. The music is very awesome, but also strikes fear into your heart when you hear it in the game. Um... They're not fun. They are not even when you have a type advantage. They're still not fun And it's also very very bad when you start in the freaking room God Thank you, Saron for taking out the guy who is next to me. Ah, Don't do that Luckily, I have a Bill Jillian Reviver Seed, so this probably isn't gonna kill me But I might end up using some Reviver Seeds because, oh my god, monster houses. Oh, you son of a friggin'. I need to take out these sand slashes so they don't sand attack. Saron can take it. If Saron can... Oh, I'm doomed. There went a reviver seed. Luckily I brought a bunch, but... Die. Okay, I'm gonna need to hit you one more time. Oh, you son of a friggin'. Duh! Duh! Sand slashes! Mm. Die! Yes, okay. Just two more ride-ons. Stop it, Saron! I know there's sand in your eyes, there's sand in mine too, but I just hit him! Thank you. Thank you! Oh, monster houses are nerve-wracking. Mm. Mm. Okay. And then the music just plays for the rest of the floor, which is... It just it makes your tensions really high. It's like... Oh. I don't... I'm very certain, though, there can't be more than one monster house in a floor. But there definitely can be more than one in a dungeon. God. Monster house, monster house. That was a... Movie. Oh, you. Link box. I don't even know. Also, 
I expended one Reviver Seed. I have eight more. Eh. I'm gonna go this way. <sighs> Alright. So, now that that's, that evil is done and said with. That was good English. Uh, oh, here's the exit. I'm gonna throw this plain seed at you. Eh! Oh no, you poisoned me. It's not like the exit's in this room. Whatever will I do? Okay. Let's just try and get out of here. That would be a good. Water gun can't be used. Let's use bite and rapid spin. Those will get you through. Not the most effective, but it gets the job done. Alright, is this a 24 dungeon? Oh, there's another floor. I'll find out momentarily. Hopefully momentarily. If it is indeed a 24 main dungeon. Honestly, that's the most logical to me. Oh my god, it's an onyx! Hi! You're big. Looming over me, and you're angry about it. <sighs> what the? I'm terrified. I didn't know that could happen to me. I can't do anything. Eh. Oh, that was weird. I've ne I, I don't remember that ever happening. It's a thing that could happen, I guess. Alright, I'm leaving. 22 floors. How many floors are there gonna be? Oh my god! Oh my god, how many moves can do I need? I can only use Bite. Okay, Bite this Onyx. It might not be pleasant, because he's made of rocks, but do it anyway, because I told you to. Got him out of Ember. Metal Claw this guy. <sighs> Money. How much money do I have? Hmm. Uh, what's this? Attract? What if I don't want to be attracted? I don't need it to be attracted. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a long hallway. Here's the exit. How many floors can this dungeon hold? The world may never know. I'm not doing too badly, though. Onyx, what are you gonna do with that gray gummy? Give me five reasons why you should have that gray gummy. I want it on my desk by tomorrow morning. One inch margins, Times New Roman, size 12 font, double spaced. We are at the midway point. <laughs> okay. I'll see you guys next time for the rest of the Magma Cavern. See you guys then.